That's what we're gonna be doing out there, all right? We're good tonight, hanging out, ready to have a party. Yes, yes, let's hear it. Okay. I grew up always playing guitar and drums. Um, my parents were musicians. I think I just kind of wanted to, to go along that line. I had the, the band in high school, and you know, I was like, Mom and Dad, I'm not going to college. I'm going to be a rock star. And... And they said, No, you're going to college. So uh, that's where I ended up. And um, you know, I thought maybe if I was gonna if I was gonna have to go to college, let me try to do something with music. Let me see if I can become some amazing radio DJ or be a recording engineer, do something, work with bands, you know, and, and try to make money doing it in the process and still make mom and dad happy and proud. <laughs> it was definitely uh, one day at college when I first went to freshman orientation and we had the accounting chair and the guy comes out, he's got this huge like 25 gallon cowboy hat on. He's like, who out there wants to make money? He was just very charismatic. It was really cool, and, and uh, I actually ended up going to uh, the, the registrar that day and changing my major to accounting. It became an awesome experience for me when I was transitioning from college to my first job. Just so happened that the senior partner was a graduate of my school. So when the firm was looking to recruit new people, they recruited through the school. I got called in for an interview. I went in and I see, you know, these posters of all these bands that I knew, and I'm like, it's really strange, you know, like, what is this? One of the partners explained that they work in the, in the entertainment business and they had a lot of clients in that industry. Then I was really interested. <laughs> and uh, they actually offered me a job right on the spot. There, there are some surprises anytime you're dealing with artists because they're on a different wavelength, but it's sort of part of our job to bring them back down to that reality. The CPA definitely has an important role because on a daily basis we're looking through their spending habits, their revenue streams, and we sort of help them make educated decisions around those hard numbers. You might have a client that has a real strong career one year and the next year they don't, or maybe they want to you know, take the year off. But what are we going to do with you know, all these people that are loading the trucks and, and, and the bus drivers? Can the band afford to take a vacation this year? Do we have to tour every year to sort of sustain this empire that we have going? If the band comes to town, there's been times where we have to drive out to wherever the concert is and bring the client their tax returns ready to be signed, and they just sit there backstage and sign all their returns real quick because they're not going to be someplace where we can FedEx them everything. You know, there's different kinds of challenges, but those are, those are the fun times because you know now you're really part of the action. You know, you're you're getting to go to the concerts, or you're hanging out with celebrities. You gotta kind of look at yourself from the outside and just relax and learn as much as you can from your your seniors, your managers, your you know the partners, and, and just take that in and use all that information to to develop yourself. It does take some time and. You know, I'm working at it. <laughs> I'm definitely happy in the career choice that I made. Being a musician, I, I definitely have learned so much more about the industry, working in it every day. But it just so happens that I found the fit that was right for me. I mean, it really feels good because if you're involved in the big picture, you're out visiting your clients. You know, you're out, you know, being part of their growth and their success and, and it's really rewarding to see that. It makes me realize that hey you know it's not so bad being on this side of the desk. <laughs>